Would you say to me? You want it? If you want it, I'll take it. What? Hello. Welcome to another episode of the Stevie Weeby Show. I'm Bob, his little b bigger brother. <laughs> All right, welcome. We have a very special episode tonight because we have oh. Kalila and Bobby Reeby and okay. Gobi, and this is our 10th episode. And what was that, Stan? You heard that Bob plays the piano? Yeah, he's very good. What else did you want to know? You wanted to see a friendly competition, piano competition on who could play the most soothing music. I kind of like that, uh, but who? what's the criteria? Who's going to be the judge? Kalila's going to be the judge. Okay, so Kalila... You're going to have to face towards the Tribe Call Quest poster. Okay. Bob, come over here. You, no, I, I think you should do first round. No, no, because she ha can't know who's I playing. Oh, uh, we don't know. Yeah, we don't know. We don't know, we don't know. We don't know. We don't know who's going right. to play. All right. So just go over there. Okay, I'll go over there. Go okay. over there. Okay. What? Okay, so well, I like both very much, but I would have to say the first one made me think about my dead father. So I and it was more like Eric Satie kind of. Yeah, yeah. So I'm gonna my vote is for the first one. Yeah, that was me. <laughs> but but just in Bob's defense, he's a lot more. Kobe, 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 but the thing is, is Bob, Bob is highly trained, he's a highly trained pianist, it's, it was fucking bullshit, because you practiced, I didn't even know that was gonna happen, a musical, so I would have created something better, Kobe, shut the fuck up, Kobe, put her on your lap, what do you mean, so she doesn't, Kobe, 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 why didn't you grab her, baby? Okay, so... You can grab her, too. Uh, Fuck. Let's move the segment over to this area, and we'll let's discuss some things. <laughs> Gobi? All right. Okay. Okay. It's Gobi, going good. Gobi, it's Gobi. Going good, right? Yeah, yeah, it's going good. I, I, that's I, I what like I, it. I like that's it. what I wanted. Uh, what, what, we, what, what are we doing? We're going we're gonna to re... Uh, we, all right. We're going to actually move the cameras. Okay, so... Can I have that or no? What? 
You're mic'd up. Oh, I'm mic'd up? You're mic'd up too. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, you're why, why, why aren't you mic'd up? If you were mic'd up, you don't have to use that. No, I'm not mic'd up. Yeah, I know, but if you were to be mic'd up. This is the Stevie Weeby Show. Okay? This is the Stevie Weeby Show. This is not DVD, ASA, or Tiger Bell. I understand. I, so I, 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 I so I'm. I'm. Okay, you're. Okay, okay. I get it. You're in my man cave. I know, but. You're in my man cave. It doesn't make any sense that you could be. You could be mic'd up too. Can you just. I'm mic'd up right now. Read the fucking. Yeah, okay, so this is a dream I had last night. Stevie Weeby Show. Bad dream. It's a bad dream. All right. How about this, though? How about this? What? I will read this, right? Yeah, yeah. But you don't laugh. What? You don't laugh. Oh, is this like the a no, contest? It's not, it's not okay, a contest. I, swear. I just don't want you to laugh I at your own I, dream. I, I, I it's weird. I you know laugh. what I mean? This was a mistake, huh? No, I love them. Uh, okay. I love them. Sorry. Okay, bad no, dream. No, bad, ready? Bad dream. Okay. Kidnapped by white mom. She was a young mother. <laughs> Trailer trashy, but had skate style. What? My legs was cut off and put back on. <laughs> Upper left. Thigh. <laughs> I thought, babe. Okay, I'm sorry. I didn't know if you were. Because I couldn't read whatever you just said there. Yeah, I just helped. All right, so that. upper left thigh. Yeah. Middle stitches <laughs> around old thigh. She had a son plus one. <laughs> Who was the other person? <laughs> Rode in front seat with two, two f f kids and mom. <laughs> had to take a picture of her son skateboarding. <laughs> they didn't have a house. <laughs> they didn't have a house. <laughs> they didn't have a house. <laughs> Slept by to Lake Tourist Area. <laughs> Is it in? I'm so sorry. Oh, God, that's so dumb. Uh, I don't know, man. I mean, my question is this I don't know. My, if somebody ever cut off my leg, right? Yeah. And then stitches back up with metal stitches. Yeah, I don't. Yeah, great. but I don't know if I would be at that inclined to s film the skateboarding. Yeah. Why, why would you want to film Gobi, the skateboarding? Gobi, do you agree? Gobi, Gobi. do you agree? <laughs> you agree? It's. You know why she's doing that? Why? Cause your breath is so. <laughs> bad. <laughs> your breath is so fucking bad. Hold up, I gotta give it. To the fuck hold up. <laughs> I've got to get some beverages. Yeah, yeah. This is a Stevie Weeby show. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Your breath is fine, Steve. Yeah, yeah, no, it's not fine, babe, because I smelled it from there, and then smelled the fucking thing, and look what the dog did. No, it's fucking midnight. Okay. Oh, shit. There's I'll take a small okay. one. Thank you. I don't need the... I don't no, want... I want you to drink. I want you to stay hydrated, okay? I have a tobacco in. I'm going to put it out. You're a good host, okay. Steve. So Jordan was on... Last night? Yeah, Jordan did the pot. Wow. Yeah, yeah, I was yeah. asking them about it. Yeah, yeah, it was pretty good. Because uh, Get Out was a fantastic movie. It was a movie. fantastic movie, yeah. Can we get just get a quick review on, like, because you had some insights, right? Some symbolism in there? Symbolic. I think I just read something afterwards that yeah. things that you would have missed, you know, things you would have missed, like little subtleties, like when she was eating the... Um, the fruity pebbles, the colored fruity pebbles, yeah, separate bedroom, from the milk. In her bedroom, yeah. It was like to separate the coloreds from the whites. Wow. Yeah, yeah, you yeah. told me that gave me goosebumps. I'm like, yeah, yeah, wow, yeah, that's yeah. really smart. You know what scene stands out uh, for me is uh, when he goes into the closet and he finds the photos. Of all the black of, guys that yeah. she had previously yeah. brought home. Yeah. And yeah. even the lesbo one. Yeah. Even the lesbo oh, one, remember the lesbo one? And then one? she was also doing research on her laptop, of, like as far as prospects, like yeah. was like the white NFL. black lesbo. That, I like that. <laughs> what was that? <laughs> when white black women do lesbo, I like that. Racial lesbian. Yeah. 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 You have to, you know what I mean? Scale um, from one to ten. What do you give the movie? Oh, I, eleven. I, I, no, I give it a nine out of ten. Really? I mean, ten uh, is mine's at least the lowest. Like, ten has to be like nine point. Like, ten is like it's almost a ten. Driver. It's it's all oh, right. right. Yeah, I mean, you know, it's a good solid it's, nine. That's good. Oh, nine point five, dude. Right. Oh, give it a nine point five then. Yeah. Yeah. 
Now, um, you told me some information about... We can talk about that. Oh. Well, it's a very good uh, Japanimation movie, and uh, you should watch it if you have a, um, a, a DVD of it. Okay, so anyway. Do you remember uh, Twilight Zone, the movie? Yeah. Do you, the movie they actually did a yeah, movie? I, I, yeah, I saw the fucking movie. Now, do you remember, remember the, like when he John Lithka or, or the plane, the the wing? Yeah, you know, the little creature in there. Yeah, on the he thought he was going crazy. Can I tell you a little story about that movie though? Yeah, you know what happened in real life in that movie, right? No. One of the, one of the leads of the movie, and two kid actresses, actor and actress of kids. Yeah. The first week of shooting, there was a helicopter scene. Where a helicopter lands, the, it crashes. Yeah. It killed the lead. Yeah. And the two lead girl, kids in it. Oh shit. They decapitated them. Really? In real life, yeah. Really? And they kept shooting. The show must go on, man. Oh, is it the one the episode where it's like the old people are like turned to kids at the end at that that? No, I don't. I don't people's. know what it was. I think they cut the scene. They're not gonna put the fucking scene. They probably cut that scene in the movie. Do you remember the episode? It's called "It's a Good Life," and there's a school teacher who drives into this town, and she meets this kid on a bike. And then the kid goes, "Do you want to meet my family?" And then yeah, I remember that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That was a good one, right? <laughs> anyway, listen, listen. This is a Stevie Weeby show. This is a Stevie Weeby show. Um, the reason why I brought that up is because. <laughs> just give me a second, dude. Hold up, dude. Please give me a second, okay? Okay, okay I just need to figure out what the fuck is going on right now. Okay. This is a variety. I, I it's a variety I know show. What it is. I wanted to just bring up fuck random. It. I fucking know, man. Okay. Let me just give me a second, dude. Please. Okay. All right, all right. Oh, God. Okay. Oh, shit. Oh, wow. That was terrible. I know. Oh. Oh. It was fun at the same time. Yeah, it was very fun, yeah. Yeah. Oh, shit. Okay. Just yeah. ease up, dude. Ease okay. up on it, all right? Okay, I'm fine, baby. Go ahead, go ahead. But let's discuss uh, what happened in that episode. The kid um, has all these family members, right? But they, they're held captive, right? Because they're not really his family members. Anything he thinks of, yeah, it's he could it, he is in control. Yeah, yeah. What is he eating, baby? Just a um, bottle. Oh, go, 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 okay. So that's what yeah, this is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. When's the last time you saw that movie? I don't know why I thought about it. No, when's the last time you saw it? It's been many, many years. Would you say 20 years you've seen it? <sighs> yeah. It's terrible. Really? Yeah. Watch it again. You'll hate it. Come on, dude. Yeah, yeah. We saw it as kids. I know, but shit that you see as a kid doesn't necessarily mean it's going to ring true today, dude. For example, give us an example of what movies you've rewatched as an adult that you were like, oh shit, this is not as good as I remember. Uh, Dreamscape. Well, there you go. Do you, go, B. You never saw Dreamscape, babe? I've never seen Oh, it's good. It's Dennis Quaid? Yeah, I know, he's in it. Damn good movie. So, for those of you who... You know who else is in it, though? Who plays the main... <laughs> Oh, the, the Warriors yeah, that come out and play. Warriors come, come out, out and, and play. play. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, it's a train wreck. I'm sorry, George. I'm so sorry. I'm trying so hard. <laughs> So this is the 10th episode. <laughs> I made it to 10, I everybody. I can't believe it. I can't believe it. Come on. Give it up I, to I Bryce. This off. Give it up to George and Gobi. Uh, What's up? What's up? What's up? I'm so sorry. sorry. I'm so sorry. Yeah. yeah I'm so sorry. No, so it's okay. She, I like it. She's an added no, feature, she's not, right? George, you like Gobi on the... Stop. Do you like Gobi on the show? Oh, sorry. 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 <laughs> uh, sorry. Sorry. Sorry, Peter. Sorry, Peter. What else do you have planned? Well, I wanted to... Um, Talk about your f fallout. Oh, okay. 
Now, no. I found out how he got started. Like, like go ahead. Playing video games. Yeah, go ahead. Like, I, I think the viewers would like to know. Yesterday, we found out that it was Jordan who introduced him to Morrowind. He did. Yeah. yeah. Jordan introduced you. Yeah. And you were against it. You're like, what the fuck I is this shit? I refuse. You're like, no. And he goes, you, you're going to really like it. And I go, nah. Is it? Is that Bethesda too? It's it's Skyrim. It's Skyrim. So it basically, the very first Skyrim. Game. No, it's not. But oh, I thought it Skyrim was. is not just this game is called Skyrim, but the games in general called Elder. Oh. It's called Elder Scrolls. Yeah. Yeah. All right. So we, Elder Scrolls we Morrowind. Yeah. We love Elder Scrolls. Elder Scrolls Oblivion. Mm -hmm. Elder Scrolls Scroll, Scrolls Skyrim. Mm -hmm. So it's all. It's, it's not called Skyrim, really. It's called Elder Scrolls. Mm -hmm. And Skyrim is just that <gasps> game. But it's all in the same world. It's like the same planet, mm -hmm. right? Yeah. So, yeah. So, Morrowind was two games before. Right. And I played that. It was RPG, right? You could, it's the same it's fucking the same thing. Shit. You okay. have the same Bretons and the high elves and everything, yeah. right? And then Oblivion came out. Masterpiece. 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 And then Skyrim came out, great mm -hmm. game, great game. Loved it. But Fallout is also great. And it's Fallout 3, company. dude. That Megaton? Oh, God. Oh, God. Do you remember the moment where you, you had to either blow it up? Yeah. There was a moment in the storyline, you could blow up Megaton. It's like the main city where you have a house there, right? Yeah, yeah, you have a house there. Or you could... Save it. You can save it, Why yeah. would you decide to blow it up? I don't know. I don't was remember. it a ghoul? I don't remember. That I don't kind of remember. Asked you to I remember there was a ten penny tower or ten. Right, oh, where, love and, ten and penny then you, towers! You, you would get that ghoul mask. Yes, and then and the feral ghouls. And then the ghouls wouldn't attack the you. The ghouls were very scary. Like, like if you're like underneath, like yeah, in the yeah. subway or something, yeah. there would be tons of them. But if you wore this mask, yeah. they wouldn't. They would think you're one of them, and they wouldn't <coughs> attack you. What was you guys' favorite version of Fallout? Oh, favorite version. It's of... in different cities each time, right? Yeah. Um, oh, do you remember New Vegas? Yeah, but it wasn't, Bethesda didn't do it. Yeah. It, they kind of loaned out the name, so it was, you couldn't, there was no place to live. But you had that, um, there was a motel, you had a room in the motel. Yeah, but there's still no place, like now you can create a colony and build workshops and yeah. do all that kind of stuff. And you love that, right? I love that aspect of it, yes. Yeah. Yeah. No, what's, what's this thing you're doing with mod? like what's this thing with the mods and everything that you're doing? Well, people create... I don't know how they license it out, but mm -hmm. people create their, you can add stuff into the game. Okay. Either Batman outfit or Amazing. more, more. Amazing. I found there was one snap and play one where you can, you know, you can only use cement, wood or steel, mm -hmm. but now there's this other thing. We can use a bunch of other elements. Like, like give me an example. Like, like ebony, whatever house, ebony? like brick or whatever fuck, whatever okay, it is. Okay, 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 okay. What do you think it is? Why do you think he likes these particular games so much? It's because it's monotonous and it's just a way to pass the time over and over again. He likes, he likes doing the same thing over and over and over again. He does like the, he likes the grind. Why is the happiness level in your places so low right now? Like the people that live at your places, why is it so low, Bryce? Why? What? Well, you, you said, said the happy. You said who gives a that, fuck? Well, you know, I think people who play the game. I don't know. I asked you the other day. I, I don't know. Because the generators are too close to the That's bedding. That's not what it is. Because I have the uh, ultimate generator that makes no noise, and there did it did go up through time. So, uh, okay. if you would talk to me before the thing. What's the highest? Where Where's your highest happiness 90, level? 90, 90. You have a ninety. <laughs> How are we doing on time, dude? We're it's, we, we, we just started. We just, we just started. started. We started. Yeah, yeah, we just started. Dude. No, because I have something very, the, the, the meat and potatoes of this, yeah. I have something planned over there. What is it? Um, Let me I want, ask you, is it going to embarrass me? No. Okay. It might scare you. Oh, okay. And you have to be uh, um, playing together side by side. With oh, God, I already know what it is. It's a Resident Evil. Did I guess it? But I don't even know how to use controls. Dude, see, um, this was gonna no, happen. No, no, no. She has to play, but her hands are gonna sweat, 
and really? you, it, we're, we'll be in a hand I, No, it's okay. Um, we're going to figure out those details, but that's the, the main, because uh, I want to, I wanted you guys to play together just the beginning when you go into the house. And it's all, I put up the settings on normal. Have her play. No, 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 no. we, we got to do it together. You have I don't to do know it how together. to use those controls. You have yeah, to but do you it know together. what's good? If you say that me, that I'm going to be the one fucking holding the fucking thing the whole time. Good. Okay, so if that's the case, then, but you have to be working cohesively, yes. like where you I tell, can tell Bob, him where go, to go. Exactly. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Now, can we, uh, can we do that? Yes. That's what's your show? Okay, that's so. That's the, that's it. This is the tenth episode, and then the next half is them gonna. No, no, no. That's it. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, that's it. No, what about you have other things no, on I here? No, that's it. Oh, I wanted this is like ASMR videos I want to do for the future, and I want to do more dream interpretation <laughs> stuff. We didn't even interpret the dream. Yeah, we all oh, yeah, okay. Dream, yeah. yeah, we'll try to interpret it. I got my leg cut off, and then I had a this metal stitching, and I freaked out. And when I realize it in my dream, I go, "What? What is this?" Do you remember what? This is when we were kids. This is the. I'm just but skating. she was, I remember she was crying and then Blood, the yeah. clam chowder was coming out of her nose oh, yeah, too. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Is there anything else you want to know about the, <laughs> well, I mean, the childhood? Past? I mean, there's a lot of things. Yeah, there's a lot of things. Yeah, there's a lot of things about it. We're going to cut to the Resident Evil, okay? Was that enough time? Yes. They're 30 minute episodes. They're 30 minutes. That's enough, Bryce? Yeah. We're yeah, we're good. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Baby, get out of there! I can't move, babe. <laughs> I told you not to trust that but, bitch. Babe, why did you just do that? Why did you just do that? Oh! <laughs> babe, get out of there! Uh, there's nothing I can do, bitch. There's nothing I can uh, resist. Well, resist. You're right, right. die. You're dying. Right trigger, right? Oh my God! Your I'm hand. Dead? Am I dead? Your, your hand. Am I dead? <laughs> Wait. Am I dead? Am I dead? Christ. Am I doing the right thing? Join us for next season on the Stevie Weeby Show. That's that's it, Fox. <laughs> that's, it, Fox. <laughs> that's the fucking show. Yeah, that's the show. That's, the show. <laughs> that's fun, right? So you guys just got done playing the first part of Resident Evil. What are your thoughts? I never want to do it again. She reminded me of Linda Blair coming down the stairs backwards. Oh, yeah. And I have trauma from that, so that shit's not my kind of game. Could you picture yourself playing a game like that, Bob, at your place? Yep. Yeah. <laughs> Be real. <laughs> Ask me again. Ask me again. Can you picture yourself playing a game like that? <laughs> so, Are we still rolling? Still rolling. Do it again. Yeah. Do it again. I'll do this for real, though. <laughs> don't laugh. Though. Okay, don't laugh. Right. You don't laugh. You don't laugh. I'm not laughing. Can you picture yourself playing a game like that on your own? <laughs> Why are you laughing? I don't want to. Do okay, we do it one more time. <laughs> All right. Okay. All right. All right. All right. Yeah, I have boogers. Yeah, I have boogers. Get the fuck. Get, get, get the fucking touch something, me like that. There's something on your something eye. On your it's like eye. a paint chip. Okay, got it. Okay. Are we still rolling? I'll put this back on. Okay. Can you really, can you picture yourself playing a game like that? Like a break from Fallout? No. Why not? Because if I could, I would, but I didn't. But also I wouldn't tolerate it because he'd be screaming every five minutes. I just don't like games where like, you have to go down this hallway. You feel claustrophobic? No, it's not that. It's just, that I have no options as a player. Well, that's the way the game's set up. It's not like- I understand. I don't like games like that. With limited supplies and weapons and stuff. No, I just don't. I don't like claustrophobic environments where I have to go straight or down a ditch. I like going out in the woods and not fighting and exploring shit. Right. 
Okay, that that's fair enough. Even with Destiny, you could still do patrols and with be your free, friends. And be free. And be free, yeah. You know? That's fair enough. I, that's fair. We we beat the game. It was. You finished the whole way. It was, yeah. you know it was terrifying. And to be honest with you, what? I don't give a shit. <laughs> <laughs> I, that's the, my, that's you literally my feeling. Like, you don't, I don't care. You don't care for this game. I don't give a fuck that you finished it with Ilani. I don't give a yeah. fuck about it. Okay. Yeah. So that concludes our episode <laughs> of the Stevie Weeby Show. That was our tenth episode. Yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And also, the next time you fucking have us here, yeah, don't do that shit. Why? Because it gets this talk. Well, we did talk, right? That was fun. That well, was, it was fun. It, it, I want to make it a little different, you know? Do piano, do the yeah. little gaming. No, that was do, nice. Oh, okay. I, was nice. I love you, man. Such a hater. Just let him do his thing. You. He's the king. You're right. I'm oh, sorry. This is his ship, okay. Say it again. Yours. Say it again. Say it again. Yeah. Oh, start from the That top. concludes. No, no, no. Just, just start from the... Do, do, will I play the game? Um, would you ever think about playing just Resident... Look at me. Just look at me. Would you ever think about playing Resident Evil? Yes. It's going to be a great game. I'm going to play it when I get home. Okay, that concludes the Stevie Weeby Show. Catch us next season. Now's our 10th. So, come on, let's clap for the 10th. Now it's time for the Little Ray's World Show. Kids' minds must grow. I got abducted by some aliens dropped in snow. Whoa. Stuck into a world that I do not know. So join me in adventures now. And I promise not to have a cow. My name is Little Ray. Hey, hey. My name is Little Ray, hey, 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 so welcome to my world, to all the boys and girls. Welcome to Little Ray's world, hee God dang, man, where the hell am I this week, man? What, are you a robot? What's your name, little guy? Beep. Beep. Your name is Beep the Robot? Beep. Okay, how the hell did you end up in this universe, man? You're in a spaceship, and somehow you got transported over here in this dimension, correct? Beep, beep, beep. Well, you're no R2-D2, man, or C-3PO, but you know what? I could kind of use someone like you, you know? What could you do? You got any capabilities, little guy? Whoa, you could teleport out of this dimension, man? Beep, beep, beep. Okay, we have to walk a hundred miles. Then you can find the parts to fix you up. Then you could teleport me out of here back to Bryan, Texas. Is that correct? Beep. Well, you know what? You could come with me. You're my little friend. I could use you, you know that? I even wrote a song about you, little robot. Your name is Beep, right? Beep. So dance with me, man. God dang robot named Beep, man. I might just keep you, brother. Here we go. Well, this you need a peep. It's a robot named Beep. He can quantum leap outside the zone like space. I'm no robotic expert.
Join us next week for another episode of Little Ray's World. See you all then.